Your child has two accounts that they can use. The MIMS account and the SLS account. The MIMS username is your child's email address. The email address uses the full name of the student. But please, check with the form teacher for the actual email address, as it may vary. If the child has forgotten the MIMS password, you can reset it by going to the school website and filling up the password reset form. Primary school students cannot do a self-reset for their MIMS account. All reset requests must be made by filling the form at the school website. The MIMS account can be used to log in to several websites and apps. The MIMS account can be used to log in to Student Icon, which is basically all the Google apps including Gmail, Google Drive and more. The account is also used to log in to the computers in school, with the same username and password. Keep your password safe. You can write your MIMS username and password in your handbook. Do not reveal your username and password to anyone. Try to remember your password after you have written it down. There are two ways you can log in to SLS. The first way is called Login with SLS. Your username will be the first five letters of your name, followed by the last five characters of your birth certificate number. SLS has its own password, and it is not the same password as MIMS. The second way to log in is called Login with MIMS. As stated before, your MIMS username is your email address, and your MIMS password is not the same as your SLS password. Reset SLS password and unlock account. Approach your form teacher to reset you password if you have forgotten it. If you kept keying in the wrong password, your account will be locked. If your account is locked, you will have to fill up the password reset form available on the school website. Take note that reset password and unlocking account are two different things. Reset MIMS password. Parents are to go to the school website to fill up the password reset form. The password will be emailed to the parent within 3 to 5 working days. After logging in with the new password, user will be prompted to change the password immediately. Please follow the password policy when changing to the new password. 